The biggest thing is, is Lipscomb defended extremely well. Uh, that was really the story of the match, at least from, from my perspective. Both teams were struggling at the service line, and that really haunted us in that third set. Um, but the difference between the two teams this evening was floor defense, and Lipscomb really put themselves in position to take quality transition swings, and most of the digs that we got were touches, and that meant that we were just throwing it up in hopes that someone could keep the ball in play. And you're, you're not gonna beat a good team um, just trying to keep a ball in play. That's not the kind of mindset that we want our hitters to have anyway. So um, that's probably the most significant thing, at least that, that I saw um, this evening. First set was okay volleyball, and the difference there was the few plays that we tried to make defensively. We were sending the ball in a different trajectory, and again, Lipscomb would put it up there to the net, and we would have to worry about all three attack points. So, um, no, it wasn't an individual thing. It was collectively, and we we thought we had made some progress, and tonight um, showed otherwise. There's a simple explanation for how you turn it around, but the execution of that is always a little bit more challenging. Like we, we have to handle the ball, and we've got um, we. We've got good attackers, um, but right now, over the last couple weeks, those attackers haven't been very effective from out of system, and we're out of system an awful lot. So we need to either very quickly improve as out of system attackers, but my preference would be um, that we get better in our first contact and put everybody in a position to be aggressive.